Hi, my name is Santi. I'm here with another wellness tip of the week. If you're bored of your usual workout routine, you might want to give functional training a try. Functional training consists of full body exercises that promote better muscular balance and joint stability. The exercises I will show you today incorporate both cardiovascular and strength training elements to give you a well-rounded workout. Let's check them out. So today we're here at the James Center YMCA. We're here with Gilbert, he's a wellness coach here, and he's gonna show us some of these functional exercises that we'll be doing for this tip. So first one we wanna show you is the kettlebell pile. For the kettlebell pile, what Gilbert's gonna do is gonna raise up the kettlebell, holding it from the bottom, he's gonna have it near his chest, he's gonna open up his legs, kinda of shoulder width apart, and he's gonna come down into a squatting motion. So as Gilbert comes down, he's squatting, and he's coming back up. And a few things to keep in mind for this exercise, Gilbert always wants to make sure that his upper body is straight, and he's also looking up instead of down or forward. Just like that. So this next step is the medicine ball slam. What Gilbert's gonna do, having the medicine ball between his hands, Gilbert's gonna go ahead and open his feet either hip width or shoulder width apart. And he's gonna proceed to raise the med ball over his head and then slamming it down on the ground, picking it up and repeating over and over. And so Gilbert's focus is not so much on focusing on slamming the ball using his arms, but trying to engage that core as he's slamming it down and picking it up. And he's working his abdominal section, his obliques, and his lower back. This next one is the Bosu stand-up. So Gilbert has a Bosu ball. First, before he got into his position, he positioned himself so that when he sat down, his lower back was towards the front of the Bosu ball. So from this position, what Gilbert's gonna do, he's gonna come down, lay down just like that, like he's doing a crunch. From there, he's gonna come forward, and he's gonna stand up, just like that. And then he's gonna repeat that over and over. All right, and for this last functional training exercise, the TRX chest press, what Gilbert's gonna do with the TRX, he's gonna go ahead and push down on the cam buckles with his thumbs, bring the TRX all the way down to fully lengthened mode. From here, he's gonna come right down the middle, placing his hands on the handles. And coming forward, Gilbert can always make this exercise harder or easier by either leaning forward or leaning back. So from this position, he can also make it easier by opening up his feet uh, hip width apart and coming down just like that. Or he can also do a split stance, one foot forward, one foot back, and doing the same thing. Always making sure that his whole body is straight and he's always keeping that core engaged by bracing it, keeping it tight. Training functionally is not only beneficial, as it promotes full body movement in different planes of motion, but it also is convenient, as it provides a balanced workout in a short amount of time. That's all for now. We'll see you next time.